Welcome back, stars. I'm Jennifer Ricardo, your proud principal of Appalachian Tapestry Magnet School of the Arts. We are so excited to have you back this year, even though it's going to be a bit different than it has in the past. Our theme this year is Adventure Awaits, and boy, are we going to have an adventure. We're excited to come back to learning whether you're coming to our Digital Academy or attending Brick and Mortar. Although things will be different and challenging, I know that our stars will continue to shine bright. Welcome back, stars. This is the front office. To keep everyone safe at ATMSA, visits to campus must be scheduled ahead of time through appointments. Parents must remain in their car during arrival and dismissal. Temperatures will be taken and hands will be disinfected upon arrival to campus. All students, staff, and visitors are required to wear masks while on campus. Our car riders with a temperature above 100 will not be allowed to exit the vehicle along with any other students in the car. Our bus riders with a temperature above 100 will be sent to the care cafe to wait for parent pickup. After temperature checks, students will report directly to their classrooms for breakfast. Students may not arrive on campus before 7.45 a.m. The school day begins at 8.30 a.m. and ends at 2.50 p.m. Students are expected to wear masks inside the classroom. Our STAR teachers will designate specific times and spaces for mask breaks as appropriate. Antibacterial hand wash and disinfectant will be used to keep hands and work areas clean. Tapestry classes will be held inside the homeroom classroom. Our brick and mortar students will use online curriculum along with Leon County Schools adopted curriculum, textbooks, and teacher created materials, assignments, and assessments. Additionally, all teachers will be using the Canvas platform for instructional support. This will provide brick and mortar students a chance to learn the Canvas platform in case we have to retreat home due to a shutdown and move to full-time digital platform. The ATMSA Digital Academy is a new way of teaching for our students. Leon County Schools bought access to a learning management system called Canvas in addition to the online curriculum and materials from Florida Virtual Schools. Teachers will also be able to incorporate their own preferred materials and best practices. All students that choose this option will remain ATMSA students and be part of our ATMSA family. The students will be on our schedule, just as our brick and mortar students, to ensure a place in their class upon their return to school. Digital Academy students must be present for attendance each day per Florida law. Digital Academy students are not expected to be on their device for the entire day, but will have designated times to log on for instruction. All Digital Academy students will be taught by ATMSA teachers and will be in communication with their teacher via Canvas as to when the student should log in for instruction, either live or recorded. The students will be kept on track with what is happening in conventional classrooms through these daily visits. There will be the expectation of daily live meetings or lessons with their teacher. Our Digital Academy stars will participate in art and PE classes online. Remember, all completed assignments should be the student's own work. Colored dots will be placed throughout the hallways and walkways to ensure students are staying six feet apart during transitions. Students will be expected to wear masks during these times. Students will keep to the right when walking in the hallway and teachers will monitor physical distancing during transitions. Custodians have been assigned a hallway to keep clean. Door handles and bathrooms will be cleaned and sanitized multiple times throughout the day. Classrooms will be arranged in a way to maximize physical distancing. Desks will be distanced six feet apart in classrooms so that students can maintain social distancing. Students will be required to wear masks in the classroom per the Leon County School District policy. Mask breaks will be provided at teacher's discretion. Student movement within the classroom will be limited. Workstations will be disinfected throughout the day and every evening. 
Students will be provided with masks if they do not have their own. To ensure student safety, all students will be eating breakfast and lunch in their classrooms daily. Breakfasts and lunches will be bagged for safe and quick distribution. Public water fountains will be disabled. ATMSA will provide reusable water bottles and opportunities for safe bottle refill. We recommend sending a bottle of water with your student each day. Recess will be allowed and teachers will follow a school-wide schedule. Students in grades K-2 to will have recess two times per day and grades 3-5 to will have an extended recess time once per day. Recess will take place at different areas on campus, including both playgrounds, the basketball courts, and the fields. There will only be one class at each area at a scheduled time. Individual classes will stick together and will not socialize with other classes at recess. Masks may be taken off during recess as long as social distancing measures are in place. Students are expected to wear masks during dismissal. All students will be held in their classrooms until their ride arrives. As buses and vans arrive on campus for pickup, riders will be escorted by staff to the bus loop. As parents arrive for car riders, staff will radio for students to come to the car pickup ramp. Parents must remain in their car during pickup. Walkers will be escorted to the walker gate and released to a parent. Parents must wear a mask when picking up walkers. Parents who are picking up a child early for an appointment should park in one of the designated parking lot spots and remain in their car. Once parked, call the front office for assistance at 850-488-7110. Parents will wait in the car and a staff member will walk the student out. Parents or guardians picking up must be in focus and must present their ID. To ensure everyone's safety, please wear a mask during this process. Everyone at ATMSA has a shared responsibility and expectation to protect the safety and health of all occupants. As per the Center for Disease Control and Prevention's guidance, cloth face coverings have been proven to reduce the spread of COVID-19 when used by people in public settings. Cloth face coverings worn over the nose and mouth serve as a protective barrier to prevent respiratory droplets from traveling into the air and onto other people when the person wearing the cloth covering coughs, sneezes, talks, or raises their voice. To protect the safety and health of all students, faculty, and staff on campus, face coverings will be required and the COVID-19 face covering policy will be implemented and enforced during the 2020-2021 school year. Face coverings will be expected in the following areas. Hallway transitions, restrooms, OFI classroom, clinic, care cafe, arrival on campus, main office, guidance office, school bus, and dismissal locations. Now let's meet our wonderful faculty and staff.
Hey stars, Miss Bradley here. I hope that all of you are ready for a big adventure this year. We can't wait to see you soar to success.